Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. This is Tiffany with Small Town 6 and I am sharing with you guys a Super Bowl video. Actually, we'll call it a Super Food Bowl video. I just thought, you know, this, this food is practical for like any party time, any get together, anything. It doesn't have to be Super Bowl because I am not sporting a Bengals outfit or a Rams outfit. We are actually Raven Nation here in my house. Uh, we have a whole room dedicated to the Baltimore Ravens. And no, we don't live anywhere near the Baltimore Ravens, but we are huge fans. So, we're not even gonna talk about their season. I mean, they were out like most of their players. <laughs> so, they didn't stand a chance. But, we love to cook for the Super Bowl. My husband is obsessed with football. Um, our house loves football. We're a big football family. So, I'm a big foodie, so I wanted to throw together some super duper easy recipes for you guys. I don't like to spend forever making all the cute little things in the kitchen because they get devoured in no time having like three guys in my house. So, I'm going to share with you three super duper easy recipes. You can make this anytime for any get together, any party. I didn't make my normal stuff I make because I just thought, let's throw it in the crock pot because that is practical. So. There's a whole group of ladies that are joining me in this Super Bowl collaboration. Um, like I said, I hate to use the word Super Bowl, but it's Super Bowl weekend, so the food kind of goes with Super Bowl, but you can cook this anytime for any get together. So when you guys get done watching my video, go check out their playlist. That way you can get all the, the fun, yummy goodies that you could even imagine. And thank you guys for watching today. I really appreciate it. If you're new, coming from someone else's channel, Welcome guys, happy to have you here. I do lots of cooking, lots of grocery hauls, and then a whole bunch of other homemaker stuff. So let's go ahead and get into it. I am going to use my crock pot for all three recipes because I know I've been on a kick with my instant pot, but I love my, my, my crock pot because you can anybody can use one that has a crock pot. And if you guys don't have one, I'm sure there are ways to, to make these recipes on the stove um, or in the oven. It's just I thought why not share a crock pot because you just throw it in there and it's done and life couldn't be easier so let's get started guys don't get don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up and hit the notification bell if you haven't done that that way you know anytime i upload let's get started guys okay guys first thing up is buffalo chicken dip so easy guys we're gonna put the liner in i got these from the dollar tree for a dollar for like a five or six pack I've already pre-cooked the chicken and just chopped it up from the Instant Pot. Gonna throw in one pack of cream cheese. You need one cup of ranch dressing. All I had was Southwest on hand, which actually gave it some extra flavor. We're gonna pour that in there. And then you need to take three-fourths a cup of buffalo sauce. Uh, we like the Sweet Baby Ray's, and actually Aldi's had it this week. So we're gonna pour that in there. And then you're gonna need a whole one and a half cups of cheddar cheese, but all you need is to take one cup of that for now, because you're gonna cook this um, for three to four hours on high, I'm sorry, three to four hours on low, or one to two hours on high. And then once it's done, you'll put the cheese in, and you are good to go. So there is the buffalo chicken dip. I put it in this bowl, I have a whole lot more than this left and some green onions on top. So easy to cook that, guys. Okay, this is a favorite of mine and my family's. Um, this is a newer recipe. Just gonna line the bottom of your crock pot. Then we are going to take one 14 ounce can of artichoke hearts. You're supposed to chop them and drain them, but I didn't, I just drained them. Then you're gonna take two cups of Parmesan cheese, which actually equaled the whole container. You're gonna take one eight ounce package of cream cheese. You're gonna take um, two thirds a cup of sour cream, and then you're gonna take a third a cup of mayo, and then two teaspoons of minced garlic. Just add all of that in there. And then next, we are going to take one 10 ounce container of spinach. I had this in the freezer. You're gonna chop it, and you can thaw it, but I just threw it in all frozen like that. And then we are going to put the crock pot on for high for one to two hours or on low three to four. And then it is good to go guys. And here is the spinach artichoke dip. Turned out perfect. Smells just like a restaurant, hun. So easy to make guys, so easy. 
Okay guys, I have such a sweet tooth, so I gotta throw dessert in. We're just gonna line our crock pot. Gonna take a box of cake mix, prepare it like the label says on the back. Just mix it together, pour it in the bottom of the crock pot. Then you're gonna take one box of instant chocolate pudding mix, which is just three ounces, prepare it like the box says with the milk. And then we're gonna take a cup of chocolate chips and we're gonna put the chocolate chips on top of this. And then you can let this cook on low for two to two and a half hours. And when it's done, serve it with ice cream or whatever. You know, I use whipped topping because we were out of ice cream. It's so good. The cake oh my gosh it's so good I didn't have any ice cream so I just put some of the strawberry whipped topping on it because chocolate and strawberry just goes together so well but it has like the cake in it with the pudding and it's such an awesome texture so there is an awesome dessert that is so easy to make are you excited to try that uh, what do you think good. you excited to try chocolate cake chocolate yeah. cake yeah. It's a bell button. Give me a huge thumbs up. Subscribe and turn on kitchen. Give me a huge thumbs up. Bye. Okay, friends, that's going to be all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it gave you some super easy party type food. Or if you're just hungry and want to throw stuff in the crock pot and have snacky stuff. I um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to check out the group playlist. I'll link it down below. Go give those ladies some love. And I appreciate it, guys. Have an awesome weekend. I'll see you next time. Love you all.